Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Miss Rose. Uh, so today I'll be doing a book review on Serpent and Dove. So this book is by Shelby Mahurin. Um, it is a YA fantasy novel, but it's one of those YA fantasy novels that I would personally categorize as an A, meaning new adult. There is swearing in this book, there's sexual scenes, um, and yeah, I would not recommend this for a teenager or anyone under the age of, well, I would say 18. <laughs> so the plot of the story is basically about a witch and a witch hunter who end up betrothed. Um, um, they end up having to get married <laughs> due to some dire circumstances. Just going along the journey with them and when will the witch hunter figure out that he's married to a witch? <laughs> um, so basically, I didn't really know much about this novel when I picked it up. I just saw that um, Sarah Jane Moss co-signed it. It was a fun read. I enjoyed it. Some things weren't as organic as I would have liked. There were some characters at the end who kind of just popped in and I was like, uh who are you <laughs> like i wasn't expecting certain characters to show up and have as much significance as they did when in prior scenes they were just there for like two seconds and didn't really leave us with much of an impression on them right like i didn't think that this person was important when i first saw them in the book and then it turns out that they played a really big role and are now going into the sequel right so for the most part i enjoyed it i loved i loved the plot twists oh my goodness i was not not expecting the plot twists at all good job Shelby because I didn't see the <laughs> come in <laughs> um I love the ending the ending the last 10% of this book the last like like 20 pages was when I was like huh okay Shelby okay Shelby I was not expecting that at all but in the ending I was like oh yeah I'm picking up the sequel to wait like a year for the next book and another year for the next book and ugh, I hate waiting so um and that's um pretty much what I thought of uh, Serpent and Dove I'm really, really, really excited to read the sequel. I am mostly excited to read about um, Blood Witches and the Blood Coven that I'm excited for. Um, the ending of the book just really gave me like Sarah J. Maas vibes. Like when um, for people who've read Throne of Glass in like the fourth or fifth book when the story took a real turn, that's how the ending felt for me because it was the adventure like i could see the adventure building i could see the adventure coming and i'm really glad that she created this first book to really build that foundation so i kind of hope she drags it out of it like i kind of hope it's a long series because <laughs> i have really high hopes for it um and i really see this book doing amazing like i can see it really taking off to be honest so my thoughts on serpent and dove by shelby Mahurin. um this was also my very first youtube video so i'm really sorry if my lighting is just flickering but i'm currently reading evermore which is the sequel to everless um once i finish that book i'll definitely do a review on that one and if there's any other books or anything else you guys would like to see from me i'd be happy to do it and um yes so thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe thank you so much for visiting my channel guys bye